Hey everybody, how y'all doing? I'm gonna give you guys a little review recap on the, I mean recap or review on a new episode of Gangster, which is on episode eight. Now this episode right here has is pretty cool, you know. I mean, it gave out a lot of info, which is something that everyone's gonna need because there's another like dispute or drama going around between two two gangs, which is pretty much the Twilights as we all know it, and along with the anti Twilights, and it seems like a certain war in the city or whatever like um warwick and nicholas and alex is at right now is really starting to take starting to take shape right now. starting to take its form or shape for the time being so if anything else let's continue okay at the beginning of the episode we have to it that um warwick and nicholas are just like fixing things up along with alex like um accompanying them or helping out a bit and that's just like only the first 10 minutes or first half it looks like but Besides the working here and there, we have to it that Alex actually has a little brother, which is pretty surprise, which is pretty surprising and shocking, you know, here and there. And of course, like um, a person is revealed in this episode that might that may be um Alex's Alex's brother by 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 a long shot, though um, it could be unlikely or not. It just depends like um how it was shown or how it it, it was done, you know. Anyways, um, Warwick decides to bring Alex to this club due to the fact that her vo her singing voice was pretty good for what it was told around the end around towards the end of the episode, and we get to find out about like um what the heck has been going on with these companies like um and so forth. We find out that there are four families that are like um keeping an eye on the Twilight. One of them is the Paul Klee. The other one is Kors Koriska. One is a uh, one is the Cristiano family, and one is the Monroe family. Surprisingly enough, like, um, these four families have different, like, um, jobs or so to take care of. Like, the Paul Clay Guild is, like, responsible for hiring mercenaries, Twilight mercenaries, while the Corsica is, like, money business handling, I believe. And the Cristiano is, like, meant for, um, well... The Christiana family is usually for the um, drugs that, um, how are you supposed to say, it? that the Twilight's needs, especially for Nick, and Monroe's usually in for business. I forgot, like, the Korska Cor family is, like, responsible for weaponry, possibly, or something. Hopefully, I read that correctly, or I've seen that correctly in the episode so far. So, anyways, uh, we have to it that it looks like some anti-Twilights are trying to kill the other Twilights due to the fact of certain tags or... Maybe some kind of grudge between them. I may have missed that, but who knows? And then we get to see this guy who's who's who who who's in who just arrived at Algastram or something. And when Alex was singing, well, she was forced to sing, by the way. I think this person who entered Algastram, who has a hoodie or something, green hoodie, he tries to enter the place where that singing voice is coming from. He, I'm pretty sure he might know he might know that voice. So that's the possibility that might be Alex's little brother. That might be around. But who knows. We might find out next episode. Because that ep next episode is called Siblings. Now this episode right here. Seems to have a lot of detailed information here and there. But the ending li literally became a cliffhanger. Because like um, these two people are about to like come in and kick in. About to cause a major ruckus or trouble for the Twilights possibly. They might be the same people that might, that might have caused trouble like two episodes back or so. Who knows. But. Guarantee right now there's been some there's like serious drama between these Twilights and anti Twilights or something you know but I don't know what the issue is but I'm pretty sure it might have been presented in this episode though I don't really I'm not even hundred percent sure if it's correct or not you know so until then I think like um, for the time being I guess like um a war or fight is breaking out between in the city between the Twilights and anti Twilights and it seems like um these two people who I think they hunt they been hunting Twilights for a while for the tags for unknown reasons, though the, I hope those reasons reveal themselves, otherwise I might have missed it during the during it was revealed the other past episodes, though I don't even remember anyway. So, overall, right now, things are starting to get a little, like, um, ugly for the time being. Between two groups, at Twilights and Anti-Twilights, along with, like, um, these other, um, events going on, things are not looking so well for for the city. Depending how it goes, it could turn into a rain of fire and bloody chaos, that's for sure. So until then, I'll see you guys in my next video. So, I'm off with it.
Have a good day, and I'll see you guys next time, right? Peace out. Bye-bye.